According to Dalton's atomic theory, compounds are formed by chemical combination of elements. So mass of compound is equal to the sum of atomic masses of elements. During a chemical change, composition of matter changes and totally new compounds formation takes place. So bond breaking and bond making takes place between two compounds. Chemical properties differ from original substances. In this experiment, we will verify what happens to the mass of reactants and products. Condition is that the reaction must be carried out in closed container. So in case gaseous product forms, it will not escape. We will use a conical flask, test tube, rubber cork and balance for this experiment. We also need solutions of calcium chloride CaCl2 and sodium sulphate Na2SO4. We will first take solution of calcium chloride in a conical flask then take sodium sulphate in a test tube we will tie a thread to the test tube and release it in the conical flask we then fix a rubber cork on the conical flask we weigh this assembly together on a balance we tilt the flask and mix the solutions in the conical flask and the test tube in each other now we weigh the assembly again we repeated the above procedure three times noted down the weights in the observation table. We now compare the weights. Try to find answers. 1. Total mass of assembly before reaction and after reaction remains same or does it change? This will remain similar in each type of reaction or not. If gaseous product is formed and assembly is open, what change will be seen in observations? Mm -hmm.